Hello, this is Olekius, and welcome back to Shadow Empire as Phoenix State. Moving on at our sedate pace. Should have these mutants wrapped up next turn, especially as the only way they can retreat is away from the deep desert, which will give us the mobility we need to move around. They can delay it one more turn. They cannot escape the inevitable. Should be wrapping up the Southern Mutants here shortly as well. I'm a little nervous, but the Lely are packing up on the west border. Darkshawn's doing their thing. Be interesting to see if they actually move to engage. This three-way battle down here is getting pretty tight. Just three hexes. I do believe that is their capital. I could be wrong. I, I have not confirmed that as yet. There's Colding. Cutting us off. Question is whether I want to send a pseudopod out into the territory over there. There we go. We'll have to recapture those mountains from the slavers, but oh well. I don't think we can do the war games this time. Unless we don't do the efficiency drive. Or I could just do neither. No, I don't want your candidate. Dream Council priorities are fine. Light sciences are... Well, I haven't discovered anything new. I think I'll move to a 50-50. Minor worker strike. Did they get that upset? No, they're going up by five. It's fine. I'll give in to their demands. It's good for the profile, we have the money. Roger that. Claymore Expert, without a doubt, that is the dominant profile. Opposing profile. And the Claymore Expert will get us what we need for our enforcement profile mission. Yes, sir. Then we have appointing a commander. So, for our new unit, mine and militia, no thank you, art, government, and autocracy, government, militia, enforcement, fist, yeah, there's a reason we're not using any of these people. Democracy, government, commerce, Price Bolton, democracy and commerce. Yeah, these are capability ones. Can I get rid of any of these people? Let's go do that efficiency drive. Failure? Well, it is actually possible. How did I roll an 89 when I have a plus 91? Still got plenty of credits. Alright, so we are looking at... Piotr Jones. Actually, who's got lowest? Rick Ionicus, I don't think is ever going to like us. Let's try him. Rick. Ionicus. Rec Ionicus. Difficulty 24. Real easy. I don't really feel like using one of those. Uh, 
I think bronze retirement, 250, make him go away. Failure, fact is halved. That was a 3d20. We lost some seniority, which makes a follow-up easier. Gracefully went into retirement. Outstanding. Who do we have at the bottom of our list? Reserve wise. Okay, nobody else is actively upset with us, so I'm not going to bother trying to retire people. Do we want an extra income tax? Getting distracted with all kinds of side deals. Oh, we make a lot of credits that way. Uh, we need an operational commander. Recruit military. Who do we get? Damien Jurison. Horseman and militia. That is a guy I can get behind. Has okay war. Has okay intelligence. There we go. His name again. Damien Jurison. Who is nowhere on this list? Get rid of least suitable. Till we see him. Although we don't have as much bureaucratic points as I would like. There he is. Congratulations, you're the new commander. All right, movement. Do I move them forward? Clearly, is not going to do anything. We'll lose some entrenchment. That would have been nice to have. Huh. It's more favorable than I expected. Recon is acceptable. That readiness, yeah, readiness is really poor. Let's give it a whirl. Either it works or it doesn't. Ugh, ouch. Doesn't hurt too bad. In which case, we'll move these guys forward. I don't think we're going to be able to attack into there. Let's try though. Where is the motorcycle? That's right, I already they're up there fighting mutants. Let's do it. See how this chews them up. Concentrated bombardment. Ooh, very concentrated. That chewed them up acceptably well. These guys, I believe, have a... Actually, they do not have a... Posture. Let me double check that. No posture. And then I don't think anybody else is going to be able to move forward. Move these back, see if we can. Soften these guys up. I'll be the only other potential attack that we make. 
We do have the posture disadvantage on this side though. But the artillery did chew them up pretty thoroughly. Yeah, we can do that. Have attack saturation. These guys don't count for much. Let's take it easy on this side. I do want an extra flank. Or extra infantry on it, on the attack. We'll do that. Yeah, that's going pretty well. Oh, oh, never mind. Do I follow up? Did chew them up. Let's try it. Enemy. Did retreat the RPGs almost immediately. But we're getting a bunch of losses for no good reason. Oh well. Meanwhile up here we'll get the buggies to do their deal. Finally these guys are done for. These are for the second machine gun core. Put them down there. It's for the siege infantry. For the eighth machine gun core. And of course we have our artillery. Well, we have to try being aggressive at some point. Tree into place. And they will continue to pounce on them. Meanwhile, the first will meet up with the rest of the first. See if we can't solve this all. The fuel is not good, so we will wait for them. I think that sets us up pretty well, in fact. No changes, no concerns, asset-wise, barely ticking along, worker-wise, not enough, not enough, oh, losing tons, but the happiness is increasing rapidly. But we should stop hemorrhaging workers here soon. Beat dig not doing as well. Rail yards coming along. First, let's get our replaced losses. We need 11 formations of soldiers, 5 of machine guns. That's actually not too bad considering all the attacking we did do. We're actually able to achieve something now. We go to construct a rail going to need about 800 industrial points. Or 405. Not bad at all. Is there any cheaper way we could do there for 324? So yeah, let's do that. Let's go around the mountain. Be a direct line, we won't do a circle route. And we can get it done this turn. That'll get us a little bit of extra supply up into there.
could also advance a little closer to Colding, but I'm going to leave the No Man's Land in there. And we'll go ahead and push forward. Wondering if maybe I should stop the postures I have set up. Actually, I don't know if we can cancel the posture and just overwrite it. I don't think I have quite enough density of forces to really want to do that too much. That is a foolish move, Colding. Foolish move. They're allowing us to outflank them. Hey, another efficiency drive. That reminds that means I can retire somebody else if I want to. No changes to the national budget. I don't want your candidate. Policy speech. I think we'll go for the heart. Yeah. I mean, that's also probably the easiest to get. Interior council priorities. No changes. Not willing to push Blelier. Let's just soften them up, see how that works out. But first, yeah, we can't get them close enough. Fourth independent belongs to sixth machine guns. That's right, I just built these. These guys are going all the way to the west. Second machine gun. Yeah, I was going to take them around the long way. So let's just bombard... There's the living daylights out of these guys. See where that puts us. Understood. They're saying that's not enough, and given the tech advantage that they have, I'm inclined to let that be. On the other side. Push them out here, we'll push them over there. Go ahead and bombard. Understood. 
I'd say that went well. And we don't want to move too far forward there. These guys are going to dive down into the fray. And we'll get these guys back to the first infantry. These ones will stand by in slightly better supply. Where's the, all right, we already moved them. Asset wise, the rails coming along. That mold is building slowly. Quality of life improvements on a C. Slowly getting the people they need. Albion losing workers. We dig losing workers. So let's make a call. Can't do much profile wise. I don't really want to sacrifice the profiles. Let's go to the zone orders. I think we're going to reduce the amount of recruits we get per turn. Zone orders 500. Turn and that's just fine. We'll bump it up to 500 though. Still no recruit bonus though. Probably eliminate that recruit bonus on the others at some point. We do need to produce a lot of ammo. Seeing benefits elsewhere. Got plenty of machinery. Anything I want to produce at this point? I think the answer is no, we really just need more people. Population wise, we're lagging behind. Some of that is we just can't keep our people happy. I mean, they are pretty happy. Albion's the only one with workers that are struggling. Be dig, they're not too happy, but we're not losing too many. And with well, we can't increase that. We can't do workers' rights. need any replacements. Have them beefed up to full strength. The core size. I don't think we're going to do core size for these guys yet. So yeah, I think that takes us to the end of this turn. I appreciate you staying to land. Please leave a comment. Let me know what you think. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time. Take care.